Hi guys, it's been a while, but I wanted to get on here and just share something with you. A little God moment that I had the other day that was pretty exciting. So we've done pretty much everything in Belize, like extracurricular that I've wanted to, besides eat Mayan food. So the other day, like I've been asking around if there's any Mayan restaurants and everybody's like, no, if you want to do that, like you have to know someone to make authentic Mayan food. So I'm like, okay, probably not going to happen. Well, God's so amazing. And he opened the door for me to try Mayan food. And that sounds so ridiculous, but it just made me think about the little things. Like God even hears the small desires of your heart and he makes it happen. And so if he has the time to listen to the small desires of our heart, like, why do we even second guess or question his ability to do the big things? Because he hears even the smallest things. He's working on the big things. Like, we just need to trust him and have faith that he is going to make it happen. And I want to share the story about the Mayan incident because it's just so sweet and how God works is incredible. But I was walking back from tutoring a little girl last week and one of the boys that lives down our street um, was sitting in the lawn crying. And I look over there and he's holding his homework packet. And so I like kind of holler at him or like ask him, cause he was far away. So I was like, hey, are you okay? And he looks at me and he stops crying and he holds up his packet and I'm like, hey buddy, if you need help with your homework, like I would love to help you. And his mom came out and I started talking to her. She set up a time for me to come and help him. And then that afternoon I went over to his house and helped with his homework packet. But when we were talking, um, his mom and I were talking, she asked me if like our host mom cooked our meals and I said yeah and she's like well my mom taught me that if anybody comes to my house I need to prepare a meal for them would you be interested in like me cooking or can I please cook for you and I'm like you don't have to do that and she's like it's like our culture please let me do that I'm like okay that's fine well then later like she's talking in a language to her son because he wasn't understanding the English version and I was like what are you speaking to him and she's like Mayan and I'm like oh my gosh you guys are Mayan and she's like yeah and so I told her how I've been like wanting to try Mayan food and she's like oh that's so awesome like yeah I'm full Mayan that's um my history and my bloodline and so today I got to eat um, black Mayan soup and she's gonna make me some other Mayan dishes while I'm here so God hears even the smallest desires of our heart and don't give up on those big prayers you've been talking about with him love you guys bye